Hi, this is a uh, demo of how to get uh, facts and rules into your knowledge base. This is a process called consultation. There are three ways we'll cover. The first is a very old-fashioned way. If we see I have a file called wumpus.pl which plays the traditional wumpus game. Uh, let's start sweep rolog and now if I put the name of the file without the extension in uh, a list I, I'll be able to uh, uh, consult it. Now when I did that prolog went out read the file and converted each term into uh, a factor or rule and added it to the knowledge base. There's a second way of doing this. I can do sweep prolog wumpus.pl and now the wumpus game is loaded right at the start. Clearly restarting prolog is a little a bit of a nuisance so um, if you uh, loaded the file right at the start you can say edit and now that it's larger uh, I can uh, let's see let's find the one message I'm hitting control F I'm typing one let's add good job um, now I will save and then I will do make. Make reconsult all files that have changed since the last time they were consulted. C M. That's control C control M. As you can see it compiled and now if I run it it says good job one. Exit prologue. I type halt. There is a final way in which we can add things to the knowledge base. If I just start sweep prolog, I can actually query a built-in uh, predicate called assert a, and uh, I could, for example, assert the fact foo. And now, if I test for foo, it will be true. This is useful for creating state when you need it. It is uh, not a good idea as a general programming tactic because it um, because Prolog indexes the database, and every time you do an assert, it must fix the database, which is not optimized for uh, for doing this. Uh, the indexer in the database, uh, in the knowledge base, is uh, highly optimized for read. Uh, if you wish to get rid of the foo, by the way, you can do there is a retract, but retract um, has problems with uh, only doing it once. And uh, if you're in a multi-threaded environment, there's all kinds of technical complications. For now, uh, d just use retract all. But you can do it that way. Um, but this is a way to modify the database. Now, if you use assert and retract within a file as part of a prolog program, uh, you must mark foo or whatever you're asserting as dynamic. That will cause the indexer to behave differently and not re-index the entire world every time. Uh, and in fact, that's such a performance hit if you fail to do that 
that they won't actually allow you. You're not allowed to do assert on static predicates. So, okay, that's how to get things in. See you in class.